Impatience. By Thea Grace Sirius. Channeling from Sirius. February 8, 2022. Many of you have been asking when, and how things are going to change on Earth. You may have been feeling impatience that things are not changing fast enough for you. You also ask why, it is that you do not have the finances, partner, or the life that you so desire. You may be feeling that you have been working tirelessly as a light worker, and staying true to your work, but still you do not have what you really want. It may seem as, if other less light-minded souls are getting more than you in their life, and your life does not seem fair. We totally understand all of your feelings, and are here to tell you that these feelings must be acknowledged, but we do say to you, do not give up at the last stand. God knows every single one of you, and he will not forget what you have done, and all will be very well in the very near future. You are all at the last stage of a very long fight, but now is not the time to give up on what you want to achieve. Many of you are war-weary, and exhausted by the battle, but we say to you, slow down now, and know that you have all been amazing, and have done a really good job for Gaia, and her own ascension. Much is changing behind the scenes on Earth, and we would ask you to find the patience inside of you to carry on to finally enjoy the fruits of your labor. Again we would ask you all to go within to meditate as often as you can, to be able to manifest that new world that you all so desire. It is also important now to go back on your life, and learn to be grateful for all those lessons that you have learned. Learn to let go of the bad feelings that you might have had for those who have done you, wrong. And learn to forgive, and forget. This is the only way to enter the new world of love, light, peace, and harmony. Everyone who has entered your life both good, and bad has had their part to play to help you to come to this stage in your own ascension. Bless those who have taught you your lessons, for that was their job. Do not hold on to grudges for they too will have their own lessons to learn in the future. If people in your life are still negative, and not willing to do the work that you have done, let them go now, and allow space for others to enter. Your main job now is to work on yourself to polish that shining diamond inside of you, to shine so brightly for others to see. Do not compare yourself to any other soul on this earth. You are unique. There is no one like you, and there never will be. Respect your differences to others, even, if there are many, but enjoy the connections that you do have. Being grateful for all that you have, enjoying the simple pleasures in life, and being at one with yourself, and those around you is the way to the new world. Much of your work can now be done within which is why we say to you meditate on your desires to manifest them into your life. Forget all those past manifestation failures. There are no accidents, and all of your life was chosen, and meant to be for you to learn, and grow personally. You may not understand every single moment, but just know that everything has helped you to be here at this very special time in Earth's ascension. Congratulate yourselves for you are the new, strong, sentient beings, and you are not the person that you were, even yesterday. If your manifestations have not happened in the past, keep going with them for they will be happening much faster now than you can ever imagine. Again we say to you to be grateful for what you do have, and know that you have so much help from all of your guides, and angels and your own star families to help you to achieve all that you so desire. We will not let you down. Listen not to the naysayers for they still have their own lessons to learn. And so we say to you yet again, whatever you may see to the contrary all is well. As light workers you may in the past have been in the minority, but what is playing out on earth at this time is waking up the majority of humanity. As way showers you woke up faster than others to be able to help, and heal them when they wake up, so to speak. It may have been hard for you to be in the minority, but you will soon begin to find it much easier when others realize that they have indeed been so tricked by the darker elements as their misdeeds come to light. 
you may have lost loved ones in these times, but know that no mistakes were made, and bless them for they have helped to awaken others around them. You miss them so much, but know that their soul goes on in another dimension, and they are still with you in their love for you. However you feel about these last two years, know that, if this so-called pandemic had not happened, even you would have been ignorant of what was actually planned for humanity by the darker element. You have awoken, and others will in time. And so dear ones we applaud you all for your hard work, and tell you that the end is in sight, the dark evil ones are leaving the planet. The ones that, are left behind have no power as they are being controlled by the light, and play acting to awaken the rest of humanity. Know that we are with you, cheering, and clapping you, as you all go past the winning post. You are indeed the chosen ones, and we bless you all. We are serious. Channeled by Thea Grace Sirius.